The following portion of daytime is sponsored by Gasparilla Festival of the Arts. Artists can now apply to join the annual Raymond James Gasparilla Festival of the Arts. This premier Tampa event is already scheduled to return next March for its 55th anniversary. Here to tell us more are the co-chairs of the festival, Cindy German and Rebecca Lane. Ladies, welcome. How are you? We're well, Thank thanks you. for having Thank us. You. Such a pleasure to have you here in your bright colors. <laughs> I'm excited to talk about this. Now, for those who may not know, I want to just dive in. What is the Raymond James Gasparilla Festival of the Arts. So the Raymond James Gasparilla Festival of the Arts is one of the premier outdoor fine arts festivals in the United States. We are in our 55th year and it is scheduled for March 1st and 2nd of 2025. We have over 30,000 visitors over the weekend. It is uh, open to anyone of any age to come visit, no entrance fee. We have a lot of interactive art. We have food options. We have live entertainment. Mm -hmm. um, of the artists that we have, approximately 250 or so are hand selected from 1,000 or so applications that we get each year. And so they're very fine artists and they're invited to be in it. Um, I like that. Well, let's dive a little more into that. What are the types of artists, since this is the application period, that do apply and want to be a part of this festival? So artists that are encouraged to apply must be 18 years old before the first day of the festival, which is March the 1st of 25. We have about 13 different mediums represented, painting, photography, sculpture, jewelry, woodworking. And to get a better sense of what type of art we represent, people can go to our website and get a sense of that. That sounds fantastic. Mm -hmm. All right, Rebecca, let's talk a little more to the artists directly that may yes. be at home and watching this. Why would you tell them that this is a great opportunity and to get involved with this? The Raymond James Gasparilla Festival of the Arts is fantastic for artists, and I can say that as an artist myself who's participated, it really launched my career professionally and it's there's an opportunity to show to like 30,000 people that you can't show to quite as easily in, in one weekend. Um, so it's a fantastic opportunity to meet um, a diverse community as Central Florida is and show your work. And it's, I, I mean, it launched my career. <laughs> so I can say personally, that it is something you definitely want to apply and That's participate cool. with. Yeah. I didn't know that it actually helped launch your career. And you did. were on the other end of I've been on both an sides, and I can tell you it's something oh. you definitely want to participate in. That's <laughs> fun. Okay, yeah. well, since you know this firsthand, tell me yeah. a little bit about the application process. What do yeah. people need to do to make sure they can solidify their spot in? Yeah, okay, great question. I feel like it's real. It's an easy process. You you go online, you apply. There's a couple questions. We need three examples of your work that are current. So it needs to be the first, like the past three years. Um, so we know what you're doing right now, because as an artist, you know that changes. Um, and then a booth shot. So we know what we're getting. Like, what are we going to be walking into? What does it look like? Um, so the booth shot's really important. Um, and then it goes through an application process of um, juried who are actual artists and it's it's a whole jury process that we do behind the scenes and um, we have about a thousand artists that apply and about 250 get in but um keep applying if you don't get in this try it again because it is highly like it's competitive but i can tell you some oh i could yeah. Ooh, some of the ones that are like, applying I've already fabulous. seen this year. I'm so excited. I <laughs> can't wait fabulous. to find out. Like yeah. you guys must have the hardest time narrowing it down to who it gets is. to be oh. there. But oh. for someone that's attended yeah. the festival, it's yeah. always amazing to see the wonderful artwork. So thank you, ladies, for all that you do to You're bring welcome. it to fruition. We appreciate Great. it. Thank, thank you for you. having yes. us. And for more information about how artists can participate in the festival, you can visit GasparillaArts.com. Daytime will be right back. The preceding portion of daytime was sponsored by Gasparilla Festival of the Arts.